I'll say that school has um, always been a positive experience to me. I, I think as I, as I started to grow up and get a little bit older uh, and, and matured, it mattered to me in different ways. Um, so when I was in elementary school, I went to Oak Grove Elementary School as well here in Durham. I, I really just wanted to go to school every day because I wanted to see my friends. That, that was it. I didn't want to be sick. I didn't want to miss a day because you feel like you missed everything that one day that you're out. Um, and then by the time I got to Neil, things started to change a little. And it was probably because I, I, I gained a little bit more independence and I was able to choose to some of the types of classes that I wanted to do to go to. And I found that I love music. Um, so I was in a band and I ended up being in a band from the time I was at middle, middle school, Neil Middle School, till the time that I graduated from Southern Durham High School. Um, and, I, and I just thought that the ability to, to change classes, um, to really be able to just choose from tons of different electives. I know they're even more so now um, than, it, than it used to be back then, but that was, that was the first time I got to, that may have been one of the first real times I actually learned how to code. Um, I guess at that time it wasn't coding, it was just learning scripts that you would type into your math book, like index and home and stuff like that. But outside of that, you know, in elementary school, we just played Oregon Trail. Um, that, that was it. Uh, so, in the ways that it was not as positive, it's probably not anything that's different from from what kids are going through today. You know, it was it was going to school and seeing the people that you were not looking forward to seeing. Um, I know everybody at some point in time in their life has dealt with the bully. You know, various various different stages of what that bully entails. Um, but that was you know that was one of those things. I felt fortunate that I was I was able to kind of um, circumvent or get around uh, some situations. Um, so I didn't really necessarily have to deal with it as much, um, but I even saw it happening to my friends and kind of spoke up when, when they were going through it as well. And, and I, I feel nowadays it's a little, it's a little different for, for kids. Uh, they, they really cannot avoid it because you have social media as well. So cyberbullying is a thing that wasn't a thing for me at that age. So. So that would be my answer to that one.